Welcome to our first ever powder coating masking experiment series video. In today's video, we're going to test out what happens when you powder coat a part that has a silicone masking cap on it. We want to see if you can prevent paint buildup by simply raising the cap slightly off the surface versus having the cap flush against the surface. For this experiment, the cap will be raised approximately 2 to 3 millimeters to prevent the paint from building up and instead tapered down for more of a flush finish. After installing the caps, we now move on to coating the parts. After powder coating and curing, it's time to see the results. For the cap that was flush against the surface, what you'll notice is that there was a slight amount of paint bridging in some areas. This was expected for this specific use of the cap. Now it's time for the cap that was slightly above the base. A few things that I noticed with this was that there was no bridging at all. But the main drawback with this method was that there was inconsistencies with how far the powder made it under the cap. So in the end, this method actually can work to prevent powder buildup, but it will likely result in inconsistent lines based on how the cap is installed and the pressure of which the powder is applied. We hope that you enjoyed this quick video. Please be sure to let us know down in the comments what other paint masking tests you'd like to see us perform in the future. 